Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I've got Evo here. Hey. MD car seat in the back. Little man is at school, but we are actually off to our very first architect meet meeting, which is super exciting. So if you've missed my last vlog, we bought a house on a block of land. We're knocking the house down because it's super, super old. And um, yeah, we're really excited to be building our dream home. I'm gonna pop up on the screen our inspiration. We've always dreamt of being able to have a U-shaped house with a pool in the center. It's gonna be one level, hopefully with an underground um, garage, and then one level up top for an at-home like little gym. That's like our plans, but we have to talk to him and obviously yeah. see what we can do on the, with the space that we have and the budget that we have as well. So, but yeah, we're super excited. So I'll pop those on the screen now so you can see our inspo and take you along for our first meeting. planning our house it just feels so surreal but I'm super excited and it's I was saying to Steve it's so weird because Josh who is our architect I was friends with his wife in high school and they've, they've been together since high school as well but it's just so crazy 15 years later now he's designing our first home like well not our first home we've actually owned one this is like our first designed and built home I suppose um yeah small world and just crazy but oh, overall so excited I just feel like he's just gets our vision and our vibe like instantly. So now we have to find a builder. We're obviously gonna to talk to a few and see who we connect with and who matches up with our budget and all that kind of stuff. But everything's like gonna start happening and the ball's rolling, which is really cool. I really don't think realistically we'll be in the new house until this time next year, which is fine. Cause I love where I live right now as well. We're only renting here, but I really love this location. I love this house as well. We literally 30 second walk to the beach, which is awesome. But yeah, it's really exciting to know this time next year we'll be in our dream home. Like, oh my gosh. I'm gonna put the camera down, pick Taj up from school now. And then tomorrow I've got hair and makeup. I'm gonna do a gym class at six, hair and makeup at 7.30. Because I've got a campaign shoot for Happy Way at one o'clock. But in between that, I've just put a big whiteboard, which has arrived. I need to put it in my car. Um, and Taylor and myself are gonna have a big content planning session. I've got these ideas that I wanna do with some videos, like reels on Instagram, that I feel like you guys will really enjoy. So we're gonna have a couple of hours just sitting down at my office down at Burley and planning out and mapping out exactly what we're gonna do. So I think I'll just take my camera along and take you guys along for a week in the life. All right, so it is the evening. Daddy's gone out to dinner with Josh and Dunga. So Taji and I are practicing writing out his words. So you've learned house today, how to spell house, and dog. And now we're moving on to mum. Oh, and you wrote cat. Yeah. Which is really write good. Write all the words up here. All right, what, what do you want me to write, mum? Um, all, all of the words. The same ones? Yeah. So dog, you say the letters. What's that letter? D. Yeah. What's this letter? O. Yeah. And this one? G. Good job. All right. here Christy's just left my hair and makeup nearly all done we just need to apply some lips and I've got a massive photo shoot today for happy way because my second flavor collaboration is releasing in like two weeks and I'm so pumped for you guys to try it in both the vegan and the way it is delicious you're gonna love it I'm so excited so good it's two flavors mixed together that's the clue I'm giving you guys but I'll take you along today while we get up to because I've got actually got two meetings before that so I'm just gonna take my camera along our favorite lip liner as you can tell oh my god so, so true So this is my setup. I'm literally just about to jump on a call, like a Zoom call with my baseline staff. We actually have all these new seamless. These are our final items, I'm pretty sure. I've got this one on right now. And I'm just about to jump on with the team and finalize it all, because I'm so happy with it. We have been working on seamless since we started baseline, but it is, it's just such a different make, fit, fabric. The sizing's different. It's been a lot more difficult than what I thought it would be, but I really feel like I'm at the point where I love it. And our seamless is actually ribbed. It's got the like little ribs here and then a slightly wider rib. It's so pretty. I just feel like it 
really brings you in here and supports you, but it's so stretchy and flexible as well. I don't have any dates coming. I'll let you guys know as soon as I know, but it'll be in the next couple of months, which is just so frigging exciting. It's only in black, but if you guys love it, I already want to bring it out and say like a khaki or a burnt orange or something really cool. But let me know below. Do you like the look of it? So pretty. Anyways, about to jump on my meeting and um, finalize everything. So I'll let you know what it's gonna come in too. It's gonna come in a jumper in bike shorts, which are the ones I've got on now. You can see the ribs so much better there. It's gonna come in longer tights as well, which is so beautiful. And I'll explain the sizing when we release it because it is slightly different to normal, but yeah, exciting. just having a planning meeting because we've got this new idea of a series of reels that we want to do so we're just planning it all out we've got an hour before our shoot and I think you guys are really gonna get a lot out of these reels yeah. Yeah. I, I've never seen anyone do them before so yeah. I know they all go well I'm so confident I wish reels would expand out to a minute though yeah only 30 seconds mm -hmm. so I reckon I reckon you just grab me well with that. Yeah. yeah. But it's a big impact in 30 seconds. I think you guys get a lot out of it. So that's what we're doing right now. Alrighty, on to our next thing for the day. We've got our little setup for our Happy Way launch. So exciting. New flavor coming. And this is your behind the scenes. Shame on me. I'm a fool for the melody. I don't want to stop right this whole thing in your mouth in there and then shot it in my mouth and then spit it out at the camera more egg it's not the way trying to get more protein into your diet life's way too short for raw eggs which is why i created chop caramel protein powder it's great in smoothies, but it's also the perfect pre-workout with water too. Mmm, chopped caramel protein cake, anyone? Those who said you can't have your cake and eat it too, you obviously never tried this. Chopped caramel protein from Happy Way. It keeps me full, boosts my energy, and ensures my body gets all the good stuff. Plus, it's made with zero artificial sweeteners and no nasties. <sighs> Hello everybody! I just wrapped up kind of announcing on my social media the new collection coming to Baseline which I'm so excited for. This week is actually crazy. By the time this goes up, I think it's going up Thursday night. Today is Monday. This week is hectic. So I've announced the new Baseline collection which is called Express Yourself and I will have a full haul coming on. Um, but make sure you guys are staying tuned to the Baseline Instagram stories because I update everything that's going on there. We're also running a competition because I'm holding a little mini event in celebration of this new range. We're doing a dance class. So three of you get the chance to win to come along to the dance class and bring your bestie and get some clothes and hang out with us. I'm gonna have a little smoothie bowl. It's gonna be a really beautiful morning. A lot of my girlfriends are coming too as well. We also have the brand new Happy Way flavor launching, which you guys have seen kind of behind the scenes. Um, I'm so excited for it. It's just delicious. So it comes in a whey and a vegan. So yum. I had it this morning with just plain almond milk. It, it was, I just can't even believe like how delicious it is. So I'm really excited to be able to show you guys some of my favorite smoothie combinations with that. On Wednesday, Hideaway, which is my other brand, which I don't really have a lot to do with. It's more Steve's baby, was my mum's, and now we run it. We're having the biggest sale we've ever had. It's the fourth birthday of Hideaway, so we're having up to 75% off, which is crazy. 
Um, and then here we have the event on Saturday and then next week we actually launch the brand new collection. So pumped. I'm actually just gonna pop some photos up on the screen of the new colors because I'm so excited for them. They're just beautiful and they all mix and match so well. Even today I've mixed and matched the Alive collection, the peachy coral kind of color with new lilac and it's so pretty. What's your favorite color from the new collection? Ooh, hello everyone. My favorite <laughs> color is the gray. Yeah, you're not really a bright I'm not, color. I'm not a bright person. Oh my gosh. I'm more of a gray kind of gal. You're kind of a dark. <laughs> kind of like a dull, dark. <laughs> dull, you're putting yourself down. In a good way, you can be dark and sexy. Yeah, dark and sensual. But some of the styles you really like, like the oh, yellow yeah. crop. I like that yellow crop. The blue spray jacket. Yep. The spray jacket, because when it's raining like this. Oh yeah, the yellow hoodie is really nice. No, We're looking fun. at it over here. <laughs> I feel like you love the, um, the grey ones this hat on. We've got these new booty shorts that are better for girls who have a shorter torso. Like they'll be perfect around you. Whereas if girls have a long torso, they're more of yeah. like a mid-rise. I've got the shortest, world's shortest torso. Yeah, so they'll be perfect for you. Yeah. Um, I'm going to wrap up this vlog here, but I thought I'd wrap it up with us chatting about a quote that I told you a couple of weeks ago and you were just like, wow. Really yeah, cute. and I feel like, you know, I feel like when people tell you, it depends who tells you a quote, I feel like you can hear a quote a thousand times, but mm. until you hear it from the right person or in like the right moment, yeah. you can't really take it in on the back of my phone. So that Is I'll, it really? Yeah. So that I always remember it. It's because when I wake up and I'm like, oh, I don't want to do the washing. And I'm like, no, the way you do anything is the way you do everything. So get up and do your washing. It's so true. Like... The way I think of it too is if you are putting 20% into your, say your health, you're putting 20% yeah. into it. Like you cannot live a high performance, successful, energetic, really connected life if you're putting 20% into your health. It helps support you to do everything else. If you're putting 20% into your health, you're most likely putting 20% into your relationships, 20% into your work, into your workouts. If you put 100% every, into everything, you're going to do that with everything you do. You're not going to be doing one thing at 20% and another thing at 100%. Yeah, exactly. Just a good reminder. Yeah, it really can like mean so much for all different areas of your life. And it does remind you just to check in with everything you're doing and how much are you actually putting into it. Because if you put in 20%, that's the kind of result that you're gonna get no matter what area of your life that you're looking at. I feel like lately I've been doing a lot of reflection and just checking in to see where I'm at, how I'm feeling and where I'm showing up or why I'm showing up that certain way or if I'm reacting or responding a certain way. A lot of journaling for me to really reflect on what's been happening and yeah, the direction I'm going in. Yeah. So. Yeah, well I might wrap this vlog up here. I'm excited to be back on YouTube. I no, I wanna hear some life changing quotes from them. Oh, oh that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. I actually did that on my Instagram the other day. Um, I just did a caption and I said like, comment below. And you guys on YouTube can do it too because I yeah. loved reading everyone's comments. What's one piece of advice that you, you would give your younger self or your kids or your little sister or brother that you just live by, swear by, or that's just made yeah. such a massive impact in your life? Or what's your favorite quote that you live by, swear by, or that's made a massive impact in your mm -hmm. life? Comment below. Yeah. I would love to read that. Otherwise, yeah, I found a new editor to get back on YouTube, so that's really exciting. My last editor, she's, um, I love her so much, but yeah, she's doing weddings on the weekend and studying at uni full time, so it's kind of why I haven't been on YouTube, but I'm excited to be back, hopefully back into my weekly vlogs, so please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any videos, and click that little bell in the corner so you get a notification each time I upload. But I'll check in with you guys next week. Bye!